Glover, congratulations. That is five in a row. And at 41 years old, now you are on the precipice of another light heavyweight title. Just absolutely crazy. How happy are you with this performance? Very happy, very happy, very blessed to be here. The one I uh, what I love. Uh, train with my family that's the most important thing i don't have a coach i have john hackam that follow me for since 2004 i have finale that i met him in 2002 2003 you know my whole career and uh even uh, guys like poatan they come right now the vibe is just like those guys are there for me man and i think is the most important thing and plus the guys in connecticut Finelli Jr., Ali, uh, you know, funny about Ali, when I talk about Ali, Ali, Ali Felix, my coach son, I remember when I met Finelli, his, his mom was pregnant, and now he's my, one of my main sparring partners. Oh, wow. <laughs> 17 wow. years old maniac. But yeah, that's how we do it. John Nando there, jiu-jitsu guys, you know. Just listening, learning from those guys, and now with the UFC, the PI, and the trifecta, you follow everything because I know my age and I know I have to be disciplined and uh, hard work and discipline. That's that's it. Well, it was a beautiful finish, and listen, you made your case to Dana in your in your talk with John after the fight. Um, you are the number one contender, and what what does the future hold for you if things go the way that you would want them to go? You know, I want that belt, man. It's a dream. That's why I'm, uh, you know, uh, uh, you know, I live a simple life. I don't fight for the money. I fight for the belt. I want that belt. That's why I'm here. That's why I'm disciplined. That's why I, I work so hard. And that's my dream. And I know it's not an easy task, you know. It's still a big fight ahead of me. Uh, but, uh, you know, just, uh, I want that chance, you know. I think I deserve it. I think I work hard for And I deserve that chance for that belt. That's, uh, I mean... My opinion, you know, and uh, hope the fans' opinion too, and everybody else. I actually just spoke with Dana, and, and we and he mentioned that, and you know, I don't want to put words in his mouth, but he definitely said, you know, I got the message loud and clear, and I, I think he has a point. So Dana is a fair man, yeah, you know. He is. Dana is a is a <clears throat> he's a fair man, and I, I know uh, that he know my hard work. Um, my finish say, say it all, you know, uh, you know, I'm uh, 41 years old here and, and the finishing fights, you know. The guys that went in the decision with John Jones, and you know, I finished them, uh, uh, Anthony Smith, and I go for finish. Chuck Liddell told me a long time ago, you want uh, the UFC to like you, go after finish fights. And yes, I open up a little bit too much. Even my coach tell me, Fanelica, you know, for John tell me like, come on, pace a little bit, you don't have to prove you, you know. But uh, I know I open up too much, but uh, you know, that's my thing. I wanted to finish fight. And I guess uh, just break the record today, most submission light heavyweight, most finish in light heavyweight, uh, you know says it all. It absolutely does. You took the words right out of my mouth. I was going to tell you about those records. They're very impressive indeed. And what a statement finish that was tonight. Congratulations on an excellent performance. I cannot wait to see what's next for you. Thank, Thank you. you so much. Thank you. Thank you. Belt is next. Thanks for watching ESPN on YouTube. For live streaming sports and premium content, subscribe to ESPN+. Plus.